my dear brothers and sisters a very good day to you in the name of our lord god and savior king jesus christ my dear brothers and sisters i'm sure you're waiting for the promised word for the month of june 2024 this is an amazing month a beautiful month in fact yesterday when i was just sitting and praying to the lord asking the lord for the promised word for the for the month of june and the lord revealed to me from the book of deuteronomy chapter 1 verse 11 where the bible says the lord god of your ancestors increase you a thousandfold and bless you according to his promise if you go and look into this work seriously it speaks about an increase increase from every side increase in your family okay that is maybe from children point of view somebody who does not have children in the family they'll be blessed with children the women will conceive then increase from other aspects of life with regards to finances prosperity success victory day to day life personal life career you know everything is a blooming time you see in most of the parts of india this month of june is the rainy season the beginning of rainy season and uh, it's going to really rain well and at the same time you see as this rain hits the ground uh, and a little few uh, a few days time from then you know, it starts slowly you see uh things start blooming or you start seeing things shooting from the uh face of the earth you see some growth happening greenery coming all around the place and it's like very beautiful and amazing today my dear brothers and sisters god is speaking about an increase in your life and my life god is speaking about the increase that he has got in store for you and for me and all round development god is speaking about all round development at the same time he speaks about the promises or speaks about the blessings that he has promised to our ancestors if you look back in the old testament you see how god promised abraham god's promise to moses and especially god's promise to abraham was amazing and uh, the people of israel the people of israel they always longed and they always wanted and also god wanted them to always remain in the blessings of abraham and jesus christ after his sufferings cross death and resurrection He did it so that you and I can come in the blessings of Abraham. If you go to Genesis chapter 12 verse 2, there you'll see what are the blessings of Abraham and the type of blessings that God has got in store for you and for me. The best is in store. This day my dear brothers and sisters, I'd like to tell you about the increase that God has got in store for you and for me. What is the increase? There where nothing is there, something will start. and there where something is there it will start increasing so same way you will see an increase in your personal life day to day life in your studies in your career in your business in your health in your family life personal life day to day life you will see yourself tasting success in each and every step of your life you will see yourself getting more and more prosperous than what you were in the past in a god's word you know Every God's word is a promise word for you and for me. Today I'd like to tell you my dear brothers and sisters, God's word for you and for me is from Deuteronomy 111 which is so very encouraging. So very encouraging, so very beautiful and so very glorious. Today I would like to pray for each and one of you watching this promise word. From wherever and whichever part of the world you may be, one thing I'd like to tell you that God's word he is faithful and just. to all that he has spoken and all that he is speaking and i like to tell you heaven and earth will pass away but his words will still remain totally made complete in your life and my life so let's close our eyes for a moment there where we are and i pray a blessing upon each and every one of you right now father god in heaven in jesus name i pray holy spirit god this very moment you have spoken to us through the word of god from Deuteronomy 111 we pray a blessing we pray a miracle and we pray for the fulfillment of god's word in our life father this word speak that speaks about increase goodness fullness father we pray that this word be made complete in this month 
and before we can cross over to the next month let every plan you have had for us for this month be made complete in our life help us to be faithful to your word in word and in deed and in every step of our life help us to move in the directions in which you want us to move in jesus name we pray amen amen and amen my dear brothers and sisters you have received your promise word and i'm sure god is faithful to his promise let us be faithful to our commitments and that what god has told us to do and that what god wants us to do just a reminder i'd like to tell you my dear brothers and sisters today is the 1st of june and i'll tell you one thing get your tithes get your offerings ready go to your respected churches go to your respected pastors hand over the tithes hand over the offerings on time don't delay and don't say i will do it tomorrow i'll do it day after tomorrow maybe in the days to come i have a few bills to be paid and then i will do no place god first in your life do all things that you need to do do it on time so that your blessings also reach you on time and also another reminder our program that was supposed to be in gomant vidya niketan hall on the 2nd of june is postponed to the next sunday it's postponed to the next following sunday which if not mistaken is 9th okay so come and be a part of this program on the 9th of june 2024 come and be a part of the program in gomant vidya niketan hall and all other programs of ours continue as usual because uh we have just got get it, we are just getting started from today onwards from uh bm hall in markaon another beautiful reminder is that my dear brothers and sisters the election results will be soon in another few days time in india so pray pray for a miracle and also pray that the leader that god has got in store for india be elected be chosen and come in power and reign from the throne in delhi okay so just pray to god just pray to god you know it's not that uh, you your words and my words have created a major impact unless and until god has decided god has not decided who should be our leader we won't have a leader so let's pray to god and ask god and tell god god the leader that you have in store for us you know come there up at the center in delhi and then rule the country from there and we pray for all our mps all our leaders and all the people uh, who will be expecting their results uh, in uh, of the forthcoming election of these elections that was held all those people will be expecting for the results let's pray that the right people whom god has chosen the right people whom god has wanted come in power and rule the country so just to inform you small information get started this time is a time where people will be busy for children's admissions and schools and this that buying shopping with regards to children's education god bless you for everything that you are doing and i pray a special blessing upon children today and i pray that your children your family increase with children first second the children increase in wisdom knowledge and intellect and the best that is there in store from god be made available for your children till we meet again have a wonderful month a glorious month and a blessed month as god has promised god bless you shalom